All right, we're going to learn how to play the next note um, on the recorder, which is low F. Gets a little bit tricky and a little bit of a challenge because you have to skip a fingering just like we did with high C. This time when we play uh, low F, you're going to be skipping one finger so that you have one key that is not covered. So the way we finger that low F is thumb, one, two, three, so the left hand has everything down. Then your first finger covers this hole. The second finger isn't going to cover anything. Then the third finger covers both of those, and then the pinky covers the bottom two holes there. Now, of course, we don't, we can't keep our second finger like this, or we'd never be able to have time to get it back in place. So you just hover it over the uh, second key on for the right hand there. All right, when you play it, it sounds like this. So that's low F. If you play it with the incorrect fingering, if you play it with the German fingering, which is also indicated on your music, then it would sound like this. Just a little bit different. Here's the right way. Wrong way. So slightly different, but it makes the uh, song sound a little funny because we have what we call a Baroque instrument, not a German instrument. <clears throat> so I'm gonna try to sing the song. Um, on uh, note names and uh, chin it while I go. Now this song was written or given to us so that we, when we play this one, we never put our second finger down. So it gives us a chance to just hover that finger right over the notes while we're playing. When we go from F to A, everything just barely lifts so that you can come right back down. I'll show you that close. So here's the F, and then when you play A, everything just, just a tiny bit up. So it just can go up and down just like that. All right. So I'm going to play it. <clears throat> if you want to play it along with me, why don't you do that? One, two, three, four. Have fun with closet key and low F.